you ever just have one of those days where it's like, man, I need a win today. Something's got to go my way. Well, after yesterday's crappy day on Spring Creek, we're on the little J today. I have my fly rod, or yeah, I have my spinning rod with me. I just got to catch a couple fish here. Maybe later on today, I'll break it out, but wind's probably blowing 10 miles an hour right now. So that makes fly fishing very difficult. So we'll probably catch a bunch of fish, I'm hoping, on the spinning rod today. And uh, yeah, we'll see where, where it takes us. There's a fish. but I'm just happy to be catching something today. All right, see you, buddy. There we go. It's a really nice one. Yeah, baby. Oh. Look at those reds. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Come on. Come on. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Come here, buddy. Awesome. Oh, good. He already popped out. Hands are wet. This is a cookie cutter. Another one. This is just a small guy. Alrighty, buddy. Ooh. Yes, graceful. Very graceful. There's another one, another small guy. Oh, okay. The good thing about catching so many fish is I don't have to keep wet my hands. My hands are already wet. So you guys see that dark line there? That's where I was picking up a lot of those fish. It's like a, a rock ledge and then it dips off and then there's another rock ledge behind it. I tried showing this on the big camera, but the it just it w wasn't picking it up but yeah big rock ledge and then it dips off here and it picks back up and the fish are sitting down in that rock ledge well we were able to put a couple fish in the net there uh i'm gonna go move spots i lost my only spinner i had with me i'm gonna move spots i feel like i really should grab the fly rod and uh, either chuck a streamer, I don't know, I don't know, but I feel like I should, I should use a fly rod a little bit. That's a fish, hells yeah. Oh buddy. Come on, I just want to know what, what I caught you on. That's it. I don't care about anything else. It's on the pheasant tail. All right.
There it is, pheasant tail, corner of the mouth. Hoo wee! I'm sorry guys, I missed the hook set on this one. Ay, 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 this guy just doesn't want to give up. Ah, there we go. Awesome. Another beautiful one. Arr, 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 arr. Hey, Mr. Brownie! There we go, he's got the Frenchie in his mouth. See you, buddy. Fish. Oh, uh... Uh, something just happened with the GoPro. I don't know what the hell's going on. I just hooked into what is probably going to be our biggest fish of the day. He's trying to go upstream and has successfully twice. Baby. On the Frenchie. We a load the form. Oh my. He's already 15 inches. That's a good fish. So, you know how I said earlier, this is probably going to be the biggest fish we catch today. You can correct that. This is going to be the biggest fish we catch today. Probably 16? I don't know. 
I really should mark my rod to know for sure. There he is, absolutely beautiful fish on the sulfur Frenchie. It has been a grind today, but once I switched to this like sulfury Frenchy thing, all it, all it has is a little bit of yellow collar on it. It's game on. Unbelievable. What a great day. Well guys, that's gonna end it for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, leave a like. It helps my videos reach more people. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. I gotta get back and get ready for tomorrow. We're heading to Penn's Creek. I'm gonna go fly fish up there for the day. Probably a full day up there if my back can take it. So thanks so much for watching. See you guys on the next video.